St. Peter's in uh, Chorley. I'm just doing some of the uh, plastering on the internal of the building where it had got um, a lot of damp and a lot of the plaster had fallen away. This is the backing coat we did yesterday. So this is a lime backing coat just to build it up because there were quite a lot of um, material that were missing and we're just um, putting on the top coat today. So it's a, it's a lime based plaster um, rather than a gypsum plaster. Uh, with the top coat, we've put in a little bit of um, casting plaster in just so we can get a nice smooth finish on it rather than a, a render finish, uh, if you will. Well, the benefit of um, doing solid plaster rather than like a dot and dab or uh, something like that is it's a lot better at uh, waterproofing the building. Obviously, we're doing the pointing on the outside so that the water coming in uh, and this is just secondary uh, protection. Um, and plus, because it's a, a historical building, we've got to put back um, the same as what was. Uh, rather than using gypsum. So when we've done the plastering and it's all dried um, fully, that we'll then um, paint the full wall and touch up any any bits of masonry or anything that he's doing after that. Yeah.